just put a good swing on it, try to stay in the zone. And, uh, you know, I knew the guy had a good fastball and a little slider and, and changeup, but I tried to keep him in the zone as much as I could. Got to a three, got to three one, got to three two, and uh, was able to get a, a kind of a hanging slider. So, um, you know, we didn't have a lot of hits tonight, but fortunately we had uh, we had enough. With how well Evaldi had been throwing through six, did you look at getting that bullpen as your best opportunity to do damage, knowing they have trouble bridging the gap to Kimbrell? Yeah, he was good tonight. I mean, you got to tip your cap, and he kept us off balance. He, he was up and down in the zone and mixing in uh, four seamers and cutters and curveballs and changeups. I mean, he had the whole arsenal to work in tonight. So when we saw him out of the game, we felt like there was there was an opportunity. And Hicks got a big walk right there to start the inning. And, um, you know, obviously we scored three right there, and we were able to shut, shut the door. The first time since July 26 that Aaron Judge played a full nine innings for you guys. What what could his presence in this lineup mean through the final 12 games? Yeah, just to have him in the lineup and, and to know he's going to, uh, you know, be there and, and, and put together good at bats and play a good right field is, is, a, is a pickup for the whole team. And, uh, you know, we feel like we're, we're getting close to playing the type of baseball that we know that we can. And, um, you know, nice like tonight when you grind it out are, are big wins.